We've got lots happening. We'll get right into it. Watching this area of some heavy rain down in far southern parts of California, uh, as well as on the I-10 through southern Arizona. This moisture is moving in our direction, and we do anticipate a round of heavy rain with the potential for some thunder showers. This may coincide with the afternoon commute. It's going to be a dry morning commute. Temperatures starting in the low in the mid 50s. We'll hover in the low and the mid 50s, I think, through the morning commute, kind of partly cloudy, but fairly quiet out there. So a decent morning. Temperatures zipping into the low 70s by about 3 o'clock this afternoon. After that, though, uh, this mild, even though it will be mostly cloudy afternoon, will give way to a round of some heavier rain. So 3 to 4 to 5 p.m., running the risk of this area of downpours moving from south to north right into Las Vegas. We're talking up to one inch of rainfall and with them some thunder showers this afternoon into this evening. We may get a lot of that one inch of rain in a short period of time. When that happens, flooding on the roads is a concern. After dark, still the potential for some occasional heavy showers tonight. Looks like there will be some more breaks in the action as we wake up Friday morning, but still a couple of additional showers are possible through the day tomorrow. So how much rain? Well, more than a half inch, hopefully less than an inch with this afternoon evening rain. Anytime we're talking one inch of rain in Las Vegas, that's when those washes tend to fill up and we have some flooding issues. So we're going to watch it carefully later today and especially as we head into the evening. Snow up in the mountains, four to eight inches above 7,500 feet, maybe up to a foot of heavy, wet snow in places like Lee Canyon. The showers kind of linger tomorrow, especially the first half of Friday, and will be a lot cooler only in the low 60s tomorrow. A bit on the breezy side through the weekend. We're going to cross our fingers for dry weather this weekend. It'll be in the mid 60s. Next week, another an entirely different big storm system delivers rain chances over a stretch of a few days. Marissa, that'll keep us chilly in the 50s next week. St. Patrick's Day Tuesday could be a bit of a washout. All right, Justin. Yeah, morning commute is expected.